you may not have seen them, but no doubt you've heard them. And uh, with the frequency we have not experienced in many, many years, reports of illegal fireworks spiking across the Golden Empire this month. And as Aton Wallace reports, with the 4th of July quickly approaching, the Kern County Fire Department is taking action to catch the perpetrators lighting up the night sky. They're loud, dangerous, and illegal. Thousands of unlawful fireworks have exploded in the streets and skies of Kern County just this month. It is staggering when we look at these numbers. Staggering, says Kern County Fire Department engineer Andrew Freeborn, noting just over the three-day period from June 19th through the 21st, KCFD received 1,912 reports of illegal fireworks. The same time last year, that number stood at just 19. Freeborn says it's tough to find an exact cause for the uptick, but he will not rule out a possible link to frustration over COVID-19. While this may seem like a night of fun, he says it can devastate lives forever. Individuals lose fingers, hands, uh, they, they injure themselves. We see that there are fires that are started, thousands of fires every year that are started across the nation by firework activity. So there is a risk in using fireworks. So how can you tell the difference between legal and illegal fireworks? Well, for starters, legal fireworks are sold only at authorized stands like this one outside the Vons in Northwest Bakersfield. Fireworks also must bear the state fire marshal seal and can be sold only between June 28th and July 6th. TNT Fireworks spokesperson Dennis Revel shared common traits of illegal fireworks. The illegal fireworks, obviously, the ones that you're seeing, the glut uh, across the country right now are uh, basically aerial items uh, such as um, borders with aerial shells that replicate uh, a public display and exploding pyrotechs and MAs, M100s, uh, which are the equivalent of a quarter stick of dynamite. State law says anyone found in possession of 25 to 100 pounds of illegal fireworks can face a $1,000 to $5,000 fine and up to one year in county jail. Be safe, be responsible, and be vigilant. If you'd like to file a fireworks complaint, you can do so by going to the Kern County Fire Department website. We have posted a link to that on our site. And if you live in the city of Bakersfield, you can call the city's non-emergency number. We have also posted a link to that on our site, kget.com. In Northwest Bakersfield, Aton Wallace, 17 News. Thanks, Aton.